you can still bring some turned on energy, sexual energy. That's not bad. That's actually a beautiful thing. It shows you like her, but you're not forcing it on her and you're not trying to get it from her. You're just enjoying it with her. And if she wants to take it in, she can. So welcome. In this video, we're going to be doing the last in a series on the subtleties that ruin attraction, the third video. In this one, we're going to be looking at um, being physically creepy and uh, physically creepy. <laughs> I'm not looking forward to doing this one because being physically creepy really creeps girls out. Um, but at the same time, uh, we do it. We don't even realize we're doing it. We got to learn, guys. And it's an energy just like anything else. Have you ever been, so I want to ask you, have you ever been that guy that a girl, you know, you start touching and she just can't wait to get away from you? Or have you been that guy that that uh, is, you're touching her and the girl can't get enough of it? Have you ever been touching a girl and holding her and enjoying her and she's really enjoying it and she points across the room and says, that guy over there, he's too touchy. And then you think, wow, I'm touching you a lot, but you're not creeped out by me. <laughs> and that's really because touch is a quality. It's a, there's a quality of your touch that either makes them feel comfortable or uncomfortable. And that's what we're gonna take a look at today. Hopefully you're not doing the uncomfortable thing and making girls run away. Because when a guy really knows how to touch well, it's amazing. It makes girls feel comfortable, yeah. safe, open. Would you agree? Yes, definitely. Awesome. awesome, and this is the beautiful Aria, by the way. I should have introduced her at the front of the, oh. at the beginning of the video, but I was too busy creeping out on her with my crazy touch. <laughs> so um, when you go out, uh, first off, how, how often do guys touch when you go out? Um, when they meet you at a bar or club, do they do they feel comfortable? Do they kind of avoid it? Uh, it doesn't happen as often. I would say like, I don't know, maybe half, tops, yeah. half of the time. Yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, when the guy More than I expected. Me. Yeah. Um, but usually they don't like nail this aspect. They're like, no. it's like they're a bit, a bit weird out about it. Like they would touch like, but like in a weird way, it doesn't feel comfortable okay. at all. We'll say said. we got 50% that touch and I'm going to say that might even be high, but we're going to go with 50%. Out of that 50%, what percentage touches well? 10%. 10%. So 10% yes. of guys touch well. What percentage of those guys are actually creepy though? I would say truly, truly creepy, again, 10%, okay. like not that high. So we got 30% that just suck at touching, 10% that are good, and 10% that are creepy. Yeah, okay, and, yeah. Uh, and so that's what we're looking at. So uh, one of the things, is, if you're really good at touching, you can touch right away. Three seconds, you know, you can walk up, say, hey, how you doing? And it'll, it'll work. You can actually grab mm -hmm. a hand right away. Hey, how you doing? Grab her hand and let it go. And girls will, sometimes they won't let it go. <laughs> um, that happens. You try to let it go and it just sticks like glue. Um, and that will happen. Now, if you're bad at touch, and this is gonna be, this is difficult for me to mimic. I'm gonna try to do it right now. Um, and you can see that. So this is, this is good touch. What good touch, I wanna go back to this before I do creepy. What good touch does is it makes her feel safe. And how you do that is you learn to feel, in a sense, grounded in your body. And if you haven't watched my video on grounding, make sure to check that out. But you feel, I feel down through this leg in a sense. It's almost like I can see through the earth. And I enjoy the feeling in my own body. I'm not nervous. I'm not pulled in. I'm not like, oh my God, is she going to hate it? I, there's a sense that that I enjoy touching my own body before I, I touch her. I can touch it and it feels really good with my hands. So then when I touch her, there's a sense that enjoyment kind of transmits into her body. So I've never said it that way, but I think that's a great way for you to practice it is can you really enjoy touching your own body? Can you walk around and touch other things? and really enjoy touching them, the ground. Can, can you feel like a piece of wood and feel this sense of grounding through the wood? If you can learn to relax and enjoy this sensation of touch, then you can transmit that sensation to her when you touch her. And that's the, that's the beautiful part of it, okay? Now, the next part. Um, if I'm gonna walk up and say hi to her, or maybe I'm on a date with her and I go to touch her, and I'm gonna try to reverse the energy now. Now I'm gonna become creepy <laughs> i'm working on it i'm thinking about it and um and so i have to feel creepy inside to be creepy I, and what that creepy is is i want like let's say i'm on a date and i want something from her or uh, i'm out at a bar and i want something I'm like i really want something maybe i haven't had sex in a while or i want to get the kiss and <laughs> there's this sense of of me trying to get and there's this sense of awkwardness when i do it and it's really hard for me to do. Yeah, you're doing it right now. And there's a sense, hey, how you doing? It's, uh, it still doesn't, it's not as creepy as I want it, damn it. And, uh, um, 
But it felt like you want to steal my hand. It's like, you're mine now. I touched you, now you're mine. <laughs> yeah. So, so we're going to play with this another way. She said, I got it partially. Now, what guys typically do is they, they tense up a lot. They pull their energy back and they do this. And then when they touch, there's this sense there's, they're not relaxed. So when they go to touch the shoulder, it's, hey, how you doing? Right there. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's it right there. That's it. I don't like that. Or they put their arm around. I see guys do this one where they don't fully put the arm down and they kind of hover. Or they put a lot of weight and they're just like, you know, there's this, this latching onto her. Remember, oh. she's a girl. You enjoy her. You relax with her. <laughs> Okay, and when you and so when you take the hand, I can literally, and I'm going to try to show this, and I don't know that it's going to show, to be honest. I can try to take energy. This is me trying to get from her, and there's a sense right here. Is that creepy? Yeah. Okay. So what I'm doing here is I'm looking at her, and I'm wanting something from her, and then I'm pulling energy with the hand. So it's a little tug in the hand. I'm like, hey, what's up? Yeah. And you feel there's this pull on her. Okay. And then there is uh, me trying to push my energy on her. Maybe I'm turned on and I come up and I'm like, hey, what's up? And there's this energy and you feel the pressure going this way. Yes. And that's that's another form of it. So it's, it's either energy pulling this way or energy pushing this way, okay? And then there's really just allowing. It's not pushing. I, grab, I touch her hand and I allow the energy through my arm from what I was talking about earlier with the grounding to flow. Yeah, this feels and, nice. And I just let it flow. And then I can, then when I touch her, the more I touch her, the more she's going to want me to touch her because it's relaxing <laughs> to her body. Yeah. And it calms her down and with this nice flow. And so again, watch if you can. Just, just I want to make sure we got this on camera. This is me trying to get. And you can feel it in my <laughs> eyes. I can feel it. So my facial expressions change and my energy, my hand is almost trying to pull and capture her. And it's subtle. This is me trying to do something to her. Like, I'm, let's say I get really turned on. I drop into my hips. They come forward just a hair. And I'm like, hey, what's up? And this is me trying to, hey, what's up? Uh, yeah, th this was the part that was missing the hand. Like, oh my God, yeah. Okay, and what, what did you just feel? Um. Exactly what I said, you were very like pushy, like, and I, I didn't feel like safe to say so. She didn't feel safe. Yeah. So what I'm doing there, and let's do it with this hand so now, is I'm doing there is again, I'm pushing with the energy this way. So I step and then I'm like trying to push my, like turn on on her and like, hey baby, what's up? And there's this sense of, <laughs> hey, how you doing? Do you feel that? Yeah, that's creepy. Stop. Okay, now we got creepy, good. No. And then I'm going to do the other one. I grab her, now I'm trying to take energy from her. I'm looking at her and I'm like, hey, what are you doing? And there's a sense of a pull on her energy. How are you doing? Yeah, no, that's just okay. that's creepy. Yeah, that's okay. the other one. I'm finally getting creepy down. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> and then um, and then there's just giving energy, which is just, I'm allowing the energy to come through my body and I'm grounding her and I'm making her relax. And that's the whole goal here, is to make her relax and feel safe and feel comforted. And, and then from there, you can go move into a little bit of turn on where you allow turn on, like you get a little turned on, you enjoy her and you allow that turn on to come through with the grounding, relaxing energy. And so I uh, hopefully this transmits to the camera uh, because this is subtle stuff, guys. If you really want a powerful lesson in this stuff, make sure you come to the Fearless Man Live where we demonstrate this stuff live and, or check out one of the Fearless Experiences where we actually have you do this work with the models where you actually learn to do it because that's the most powerful way to get it. It's hard to really get this stuff on camera. I know it does translate some because I've been checking it out and I was afraid to try it because I didn't know if it would translate, but it seems like it has been with some of the other uh, demos we've been doing. And just remember guys that when I was doing the pulling creepy part where I was actually pulling on her and, and there was a subtle pull of energy that's like, hey, I'm gonna get you. That's more of a needy creepy. That's needy creepy touch, right? Hey, how you doing? And that energy right there. Mm -hmm. When I'm doing the, uh, the pushing creepy, where I'm trying to push my energy on her, uh, it was, uh, that's more of the cocky creepy, okay? That's more of like a cocky creepy kind of energy. And then there's just being with her and enjoying her. You can still bring some turned on energy, sexual energy. That's not bad. That's actually a beautiful thing. It shows you like her, but you're not forcing it on her and you're not trying to get it from her. You're just enjoying it with her. And if she wants to take it in, she can. And if you're being really uh, good energy like that, nice energy, and you really care about the human being in front of you, then she's probably gonna let it in. 
unless she's got a good reason not to, like she's married or something. And she's like, no, no, no. But that doesn't mean she won't appreciate the attempt. But if you really want to get it, check out a Fearless Man Live or check out one of our experience workshops. And with that said, um, is there anything you want to add? No, actually good. no. <laughs> I did creepy pretty well? Yes, you did. I'm proud, yeah. yeah. I'm proud of myself, guys. <laughs> so um, this one, I really want to hear your comments on. Did I nail creepy? Can you see it on the camera? What do you think of it? Do you want more creepy videos? Uh, <laughs> you know, uh, something like that. Um, but um, with that said, um, Make sure to like if you like this video, if you learned something, you got some value out of it, uh, definitely like the video. Um, make sure to uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed and uh, make sure to check out the other videos in the series. We had uh, um, a video on being needy and we had a video on being overly cocky. And those are some powerful videos. And if you like these videos and you have some other energies you want me to play with, with the models, like some that we're not thinking of right now and you want to add more to the list, put it in the comments. We'll seriously consider doing them for you because I kind of have fun playing and figuring out how to feel these energies and doing them with the models. And, and it's cool. And we, the less creepy guys out there, the better, the happier the women, the happier <laughs> men. Life gets just gets yeah. better all around. Yeah. So uh, again, with that said, make sure to like if you haven't liked. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Make sure to comment. I already talked all about that. And remember, only the confident really live. See you in the next video.